Welcome back to another episode of Triple Z Outdoors. Today is September 9th or 10th, and as you see, our food plot's not looking well. We came in, we sprayed it three times, two times with glyphosate and 2,4-D, the last time with just strictly glyphosate. Then we planted in this plot, our north plot on this permission farm, I planted a, a fall forage blend and we had good germination and then the heat hit us. We had two spurts that was over the hundreds and everything fizzled out. The brassicas, you know, were three to four inches tall after a couple weeks. Heat came, they're gone. So we're gonna try to save these two plots with winter rye, not rye grass, but winter rye. Might throw in some clover too for next year, but we are going to cultivate this, get seed down, we got rain coming. It should germinate quickly. I brought the garden tractor. I'm gonna put down about 25 pounds. This is a little under a 20th of an acre. Put in about 25 pounds, save the other half. I'll come in another couple weeks, throw it again. That way we're filling horizontally, not vertically. They have been hitting the licking branch, mock scrape that I put in. So we're gonna get this cultivated, get rye down, clover down, and hopefully that will germinate quick with the rain that we have make a nice green flu pot. So we got that all tilled up. It's looking good. We are going to put in some hot chick from Domain and then some perennial ryegrass. So the hot chick here, mix of chicory and clover. So hopefully we'll put that in. Not really looking for this year, but for next year. Then all next year we'll just have to mow it. So then we got Northwood whitetail or Northwoods rye um, from John Comp. Um, we're gonna get that spread, and then we're gonna rake it in, and we should be done here, so. Okay, we just got all the seed down. You can see we got really good coverage. There's a bunch of seed everywhere. I put that rye down really heavy, but uh, we're gonna put the seed away, hook up the little rake, and we'll rake everything in, and then we'll move to our south plot. We are just getting into spot number two, and it is just as starry as the other one. I mean, very dead. There's some brassicas in here, but they just, no good. So, we're gonna rake this up, just like we did the other one. I won't do too much talking, I think. We'll get it raked up, and I'm just going to put, probably put rye on all of it, so it goes all the way back, but it's just, nothing grew, no luck on the brassicas, but 
we can still get Ryan here and save the plot. So they'll be green late into winter for them. So let's get that done and get going. All right, so just got done seeding the rye into this food plot. Got the majority of it cultivated up. Some of it I didn't. I threw rye on it just to see how much of a difference there is between working the soil and not working the soil. So we'll come back in maybe a week or two, overseed again, and see how everything's doing. If this helps, Make sure to like and subscribe. Hopefully, your food plots are doing good. If not, this is something you could do to hopefully save your food plots and save your season. So, you got a little bit of time now. It's like mid-September. Get out. Save your plots if there's a fail. You got this. Good luck. <laughs>